this is pages 68 and 69. This is this is my C scale. So we've actually learned these way back in book A, but this is kind of a little bit of a review. We'll also be going to uh, start putting our hands together and playing uh, right hand, left hand together. So let's go ahead and take a look at the five finger scale on the bass staff, okay? Um, so we're looking at starting at base C and then moving up. So when we're here, we're going to be moving up towards middle C. Okay. So if you take a look, C, the pearl is in the C. Hey, diddle diddle, what's in the middle, right in the middle line is D. Hey, diddle diddle, step up to E. And the bass clef line, this one, I like to use it as line four, is F. And A is the top line, step down to G. You can also find F by looking at the two uh, buttons of the bass clef, and that line is always going to be F. So this is mainly a review of actually your uh, uh, right hand, left hand C scales. Now we're really taking a look at the notes and uh, recognizing them on the staff lines, okay? So C, D, E, F, G, G, F, B, D, C. Page 69, measure five. This is your middle C with your right hand. C, E, D. Is, uh, those notes are ones that you are going to be able to recognize. <laughs> uh, this is optional, but I think you can probably do this. This is both hands together. Measure nine. C, D, E, F, G, G, F, E, D, C. Let's go ahead and do the counting beats. This lesson is starting to recognize your bass clef C scale notes on the staff. You can also take a look at the discovery. Can you name the notes of the C five finger scale forward and backwards? That's just a little bit of an extra.